Good morning, everyone. Mr. House Shipper here. So, hey, I wanted to bring you a quick video of our option guide book for 2022 and 2023. This book hosts all the colors and uh, and different color schemes and options that we offer for our homes. Um, so, I wanted it's very important to go over this with you guys. I'll be sending this to any any online orders so you can go through and pick the different colors and options for your home. There is a table of contents that shows you what um, what the colors represent or what areas of the of the decor book have what colors there. The first section that you'll come to is the cabinet section. Um, the first cabinet choice is going to be the Crescent Oak, which is a standard solid wood cabinet. The second cabinet selection is going to be the Ozark Shaker cabinet, which is a upgraded wrapped cabinet. Third selection is the Umber Oak cabinet, which is a standard solid wood cabinet. And then the last selection that you have is the Crescent White cab Shaker Cabinet. Uh, keep in mind, these cabinets are the only selections of cabinets that we offer through Champion. You do have the option of ordering the home without cabinets, um, and you can site install your own cabinets. The next selection are going to be the countertops. We have several different selections um, for options on the countertops here. The first category for the countertops are the standard countertops. Um, it's a it's a sort of a dull finish. It doesn't have a shine or a sheen to the to the top of it. And those are all the standard options. The high definition cabinets are the upgraded cap countertops. I'm sorry, are the upgraded countertops, and those have a glossy or a shiny finish to the top of them. And those are the two differences between the standard and the upgraded countertops. Every color selection that you see there is available. Up next will be the backsplash. Whenever you do sheetrock in a home, the backsplash is a standard. It will be one row of backsplash over every sink, every vanity, every tub. Um, just one row of the glass backsplash is a standard option for all the homes with sheetrock. Then you have some options to upgrade the backsplash. You can do, uh, there's two options of a brick backsplash or brick pattern and then you have an option for a ceramic tile backsplash usually you can run those all the way and you do have the option of doing either backsplashes or any of the backsplashes all the way up to the uh, cabinets um, that is an upgrade it's not a standard but you do have that option the next choices that you have is going to be the tile for the shower. This is for the shower only. It's not for the floor. It's for the shower. The shower is, if you do tile the shower, that is an upgrade. Um, it's not a standard. Uh, but And the tile is pretty self-explanatory. You've got three choices that you can choose from. You do have the option in modulars of, of leaving it untiled, and you can do your own different selection of tile on site. You can just go outside and, and choose those colors. But that is the option that you have if you upgrade the shower and do a tile, ceramic tile shower. The vinyl flooring is up next. This is a standard option. Doesn't cost you anything to do vinyl flooring in the wet areas. So the bathroom, the kitchen, um, some hallways, the print will show uh, a checkered box. Um, and those checkered boxes is where the actual uh, vinyl floor will be installed as a standard. Um, and this is a congolium floor. It's a, it's a thicker um, linoleum type floor and it's a great floor as a standard option. Um, and those are the choices that you have for your standard uh, vinyl floor options. Next is the Elements Floor, which is an upgraded floor option. Those are glue down floors. Um, those strips are about six inches by two foot or three foot. Um, and those, again, are an upgraded option to the linoleum um, that you can order. You do have a tile floor option. You've got one choice there on the tile. Um, the, that is a upgraded option that you have. And then you have laminate flooring choices also as an upgraded floor that you have. And again, those tile, laminate, or vinyl floors are upgrades. So your carpet is going to be standard usually in the bedrooms, living rooms. Those are uh, marked on the floor plan as just the open, um, no check or no box areas. That if you decide to keep the carpet, the standard option is a carpet, it does not change the uh, price. It does not add an upgrade to your order if you do carpet in those areas. There are two different gauges of carpet, but that will not be charged to you as an upgrade. I don't upgrade that cost to you. So if you choose a carpet, that carpet is a standard as long as it's in stock. 
The primer option for the walls is going to be a sugar soap. You don't have any other um, choices for that. That, again, is a primer, so you would want to paint those walls later on down the road if you'd like. But that is a standard option on all the walls is the sugar soap paint. When you don't have a sheetrock option on the walls, you get what's called vinyl over gypsum, which is a vinyl finish over top of a sheetrock, a, uh, I think it's a quarter inch sheetrock wall. You do have two choices for that. That's usually in single wides and double wides and in closets on some modulars. So if you don't want to have the vinyl over gypsum in the closet and you do have a modular, you will want to make sure that you option that in because some modulars are standard with that in the closet. Then coming along to your exterior, your vinyl siding. The first section that you come to is gonna be a standard vinyl siding option. Um, those are all standard colors. Doesn't cost you anything to, to choose those colors. And then the next section are gonna be the premium siding options. Those are upgraded colors. Those do cost you a little bit more depending on the size of the home, but those that section is the upgraded vinyl section. Then you've got the board batten. Those are upgrades. You can do that the entire uh, outside of the home, or you can do that in different sections under gables. Um, you can order extra for porches and things like that, but those are the selections that you have for the exterior of the home. Next up is gonna be your shingles. Right now we use a IKO Cambridge or Marathon shingle, a 20 and or 25 and a 30 year shingle. Um, all of the modulars come standard with the architectural shingle. Some of the double wides come standard with a three tab shingle. So you'll wanna make sure that if you get a double wide and you wanna have the architectural, you upgrade those shingles to the architectural. So up next would be your shutters. Shutters are standard on the front of the home only. Um, if you want to order extra for the back or side, that would be an additional cost. But if you choose shutters, you can choose any of these colors. Um, there is no upgrade on the shutters. And like I said, they come on the front windows only as a standard. So guys, on top of those choices that I just showed you, you have choices of, uh, especially on the modulars, of changing layouts and adding walls and, and rearranging kitchens and things like that um, that you won't see in the decor book. The decor book is mainly for colors, uh, but you do have uh, kitchen options where you can do ultimate kitchen. Um, you can do a ultimate bathroom or an upgraded bathroom, a glamour bath, um, you know, things like that. You can do an ambassador's closet in some of the master closets. Um, you can do tile showers, walk-in showers as options that you can insert into plans. So each plan has a, another set of different upgrades or options that you can insert into the plan. So you just wanna make sure once you pick your plan out that you verify what additional changes or options can be made to that plan. I appreciate you guys watching my video. I hope you enjoyed it. Come back and watch more. Bye-bye.